It's a beautiful day. It's a beautiful day to unveil our new bike. Cue the intro. Hello. What's up guys? It's your boy Freddy Rods. Alright, so what is this? One clue that I'll give you. And it's not a Honda Grom. Just like I put a sticker there. It's not a Grom. So what is it? Yeah. I wanted to do a video on pretty much what this is and what we got because I've seen all these come across the internet and the YouTube and all social media and they get a lot of hate um, especially from the ground guys like it is not a Honda Grom it looks like a Honda Grom but it's not it's a Chinese clone of a Honda Grom so it's a clone pretty much um, official name for it is the Boone Vader 125 BD 125-10 if you're getting technical right so yeah let's uh let's uh cut to some cinematics and show you what I've done to it in the last week since I got it so all right so cue cinematics and three two one I've been in Let's, let's talk about what this is, right? I love the lights though. Those lights. That's pretty much what it is, right? All right. So this, this is a Chinese clone of a Honda Ground. Why did I get one? Why this one, right? Well, I bought it brand new. I wanted to do a video on how this came well this is how it came right here um, it came in a box to be honest right it didn't have the front tire attached to it and the shock so well in the in the bar the bars were off um, so it came ship in the box how much twelve hundred dollars shipped to my door um, yes so why why a clone right it's twelve hundred dollars right first of all what is the difference between this and a grom um well the grom is a grom honda right it's gonna it's gonna last you for that price tag it's gonna last you for what it is these you have to have a little bit of mechanical knowledge to work on these right um and i got it because i wanted a small little project that i wanted to uh, work on and just learn, you know, I never worked with uh, carburetor bikes before. So that's something that I wanted to learn. And I mean, we have the 50, which is pretty much the same engine that this has. Um, same engine, meaning the pit bike engine uh, with the clutch. So it is a 125 CC, um, pretty much tops out of 50, 55 miles an hour. What else? It's carbureted. So that's the difference between this and a Grom. The Grom is fuel injected, this is carbureted. Um, it has a pit bike, pretty much a pit bike engine, 125cc pit bike engine with Grom fairings, right? Um, so why did I get one? Money, right? <laughs> when it all comes down to it, this is a third of the price of a Honda Grom, right? What am I gonna do to a Honda Grom for, for you know, out of the box? If I went to the dealership today, and wanted to get a Honda Grom or a Z125, which is the same, you know, things. Out of the gag, I wanted to get an exhaust, get new new bars, new grips, the new uh, like a different setup for for it, what whatever. Um, I wanted to get the the, the stunned sub cage, maybe some frame sliders, all of that, right? And the price tag would have gone up to almost four or five grand if I wanted to put it there which in this one 
I'll start with a thousand dollars and I have more money to put onto it that you know if it gets stolen if I drop it I'm not dropping a three thousand dollar project I'm dropping a thousand dollar project I mean bottom line it's it's what it what, you know it comes down to it how much can I afford what can I do with it anything this could do anything that a ground could do um, so it still it uses all the Honda parts minus the engine right I could, I could replace all Honda fairings on it seat um, bars everything uh, as far as hardware on it shocks exhaust the, the pegs the brake calipers rotors tires I could replace everything that with Honda parts except the engine right um, so that pretty much tells me that I could you know it's upgradable like I started with a blank slate pretty much I mean I've changed all the hardware I locked tight all anything anything mechanical that I could do engine bolts twice um, I've locked out all the um, spring the I changed the axle nuts to a Honda already the Honda uh, Grom axle bolts and and nuts um, yeah this is pretty much the new the new little 125 that we wanted to get right um, there's still more parts to it that I wanted to get but I just wanted to do the video as a reveal and stuff that we done so far take you a little little ride around the parking lot because it's pretty much fun like I already had it like I said for a week and I can't get off of it you know it's it's so it's a fun little toy fun little bike that you know I already put my spin on it how I want it and yeah so let's get down to what I did I put new turn signals um, I got some pro taper uh, KX uh, high bars um, got levers got new new grips my Impatec stunt one finger clutch I got some mirrors um, that's so far uh, of the front end and that I did um, coming down here I got a, a Makuni uh, VM, VM22 carburetor um, so I replaced all the stock that I came with with a Makuni clone uh, or fake Makuni carburetor um, I had some I had some uh, frame slotters lying around and guess what they fit I mean I had to grind them down a little bit there but they fit pretty much good there like as a, as a, as a protection crash protection right um, like I said these are pit bike engines so they're geared with a pit bike uh, gearing so I went to a 16 sprocket um, 16 17 you could go to at least get that top end a little bit more um, 55 60 depending on, on on the jets on the carburetor if I wanted to so I got probably have to rejet the carburetor but as far as stock coming out of the box this is it I got a, a, a little clone Honda clone there I went to TSD and got me the plate plate uh, holder from TSD Industries um, yeah <laughs> this is it guys this is the little the little engine that could I'm a color I'm a color sonic because it's blue and it's my favorite look at this it's the same colors right we all match we all want to be power rangers so i had to put a sticker that says it's not a grom because it's guess what it is not a grom right um so let's fire up and i mean right now it doesn't have an exhaust so it doesn't sound like that much but it, it's a little, little thing right yep so exhaust comes out comes in in the next couple of weeks because it's, it's, it's a cheap one coming from china once again the, the parts are cheap um so far what's well, spent it from the day i got it to now is about two hundred dollars extra um so it puts the build at a fourteen hundred dollar build right there for a 125 cc grom clone right that's including the the lights the carburetor the sprocket the bars 
the mirrors, the, the levers. The Impatec lever already had it, so I'm not counting that. But it comes with a different lever that you can put in your clutch, I mean your clutch side. Um, and then there was twelve dollars for that that tail light, which it works, right? Did it happen backwards? No, yeah, it goes like that. All right. Yeah. I mean that's that's how much I put on it. But I know what you want to do. You want to ride. So guess what? All right, guys. Let's see. But as you can tell, this is first gear right now. It tells you to shift. Only has four gears in neutral, right? So first gear, it'll tell you to switch. Second gear, I mean, it's already, it's pretty fun just having it around. It's the same thing as a Grom that gearing it goes to, right? Um, but yeah. This is, this is, this is it. It doesn't get any better than this. So why did we get these? Just to have fun, like right now. I'm just, I could come into the parking lot, right here, empty parking lot, and just do some drills, pop a wheelie if I wanted to, um, which I already tried, which is pretty good. Let's see, let's, let's try, try this. Oh, let's try, I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. Let's go this way. Ready? Yeah! Huh? I popped the wheelie off the ground. So that counts as a wheelie, right? Um, but yeah, no, these are stupid fun. Like, we already rode it around the neighborhood here. Like, just going around the back roads and going in anywhere. Like, I could put their tires on these that come like ribbed for dirt and just have a whole different fun you know what i'm saying like but yeah just wanted to give you guys a bike reveal see how this one looks see what your thoughts about it um once again real cheap if you but the outside of these that you want to get one because i have a lot of people already telling me yo what you got it how much i want to get one if you don't know much about mechanical things and you want to you don't know how to tinker and and i would not recommend it because a lot of people and this is something that i've seen from from the uh the facebook groups that they get this as a first bike because it's being so cheap but they don't know how to adjust the chain they don't know how oh my bike doesn't start where's the first thing i gotta look you know check for spark check for everything you know what i'm saying is it fuel is it is it um the starter is it what the battery dot you know what i'm saying like if you don't know how to work on a motorcycle and follow a simple diagram of of you know air fuel spark and you don't understand i would not recommend these just in that sense point blank um if you are looking for something to grab anywhere and go and be ready for it might as well just save up and get a gram honestly just because that's that's the reality right these are meant for a little project upgradables their reliability i will put it at a maybe two to three stars um just because i know i know the more i ride this i'm gonna break it i'm gonna break parts i'm gonna break engine bolts i'm gonna i'm gonna break a lot of things on this one and easy reversible for you know for for what it is if i had a, a gram and i expect that that quality from honda and i break it then i'll be you know i'll be those you know you 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 just spend almost five grand on a brand new gram and it doesn't perform the way you want to then you're gonna be you know what i'm saying kind of salty about it but with this i know what i got into it i know what i I'm, i could get into it and out of it and my expectations for it so far out of the box they've been great right i got it out of the box i started it up changed the oil changed all that stuff i had it running uh within within a couple hours with all i wanted to do and after that it's been like this more upgrades and more upgrades that i've been doing just to mess around with it and 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 chill right but 
this is what it is guys it's a little fun a little bike just to mess around and go around stuff um but yeah so that's i just wanted to you know show you guys what we got because this is this is mine and mine alone so i could do whatever i want with it but this is my little i'm gonna call her sonic because it's blue so this is my little sonic um right um questions and everything just let, leave a comment uh i'll leave the uh, in the video here um make sure you like if you like it if subscribe um this is gonna i'm probably gonna make a i'm gonna play make a playlist for any videos that we do on these because expect some some videos out of it because this is it's gonna be fun this is gonna be fun um but yeah guys uh thanks for watching once again it's your boy freddy rods deuces